This pyramid in the desert is home to over 200 cars and vehicles dating from the late 1880s all the way to 2007. You'll even find some of the most extraordinary caravans in the world. But there's just one problem. It's actually about the size of a four-storey building. So it might be a bit tricky to tow with your SUV. But for the world's biggest caravan, you'll need the world's biggest truck. It's much more than just a car. It is, in fact, a four-bedroom house with all the modern conveniences. But don't think it just sits here in the museum gathering dust. It is, in fact, a fully functioning car. And its owner, Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan, has been known to take it for a spin in the desert. And have you ever wondered what planet Earth would look like on wheels? I'm standing here on what you could describe as a caravan. It's actually a ten-bedroom mansion spread over three floors in the shape of a globe. This unique mobile home is exactly a millionth of the size of the Earth. All these vehicles have been carefully collected by their owner, Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayan, over the last 20 years. Each of his 200 cars tells a personal story, and he showed me a few of his favourites. Of course, it's my hobby, and it's a headache uh, hobby. But our uh, collection is from different category and my favorite is the of course the off-road car the SUVs and big cars and jeeps and we actually we are also building now the biggest jeep in the world this is motorhome the the Dodge and the Globe and the we call it the Hotage the big one the black one so what made you think to build these fast you mean the homes? big uh, unit this is uh, in the old days before we get this land here. Uh, we was like a Bedouin, you know, moving from one place to other with the family, of course, by, by big trucks. We have one car here is a real car, you know, it's old, but brand new. So if you want, we can go and see. This is the best one because it's uh, original paint, original uh, inside, and it's only 200 mile in the mileage, so it's brand new from the 54, so it's more than 50 years old. But the most expensive one is the Rolls Royce there. That one, 500,000 pound. This is the first car in the world. It's a replica of Mercedes. They built it in 1886. It's come a long way in, in a little over 100 years, hasn't yeah, it? Nobody but... believe when we say this is Mercedes. When Mercedes built an electric car to mark their 100 year anniversary in 1986, Sheikh Hamad had to have one too. We asked him if we can buy this uh, car. They said no. This is only uh, demo. I said maybe I can close myself. So we we took one plastic one model, small one. From that one we scale it up to this. In Egypt, in ancient Egypt, the pyramid is grave. So this is grave of the car. And the last resting place of Sheikh Hamad's cars is open to the public by appointment.